Hey, today we're going to be doing the inside out French braid. Sort of a twist on a regular French braid. It's really simple, really snappy, and really cute. First, you're going to separate your thing into three sections. Like that. Okay. This is just like the regular French braid, except for instead of crossing your strings over, you're going to go underneath. Like that. So, you're going to take your first outside out piece, inside outside piece, and bring it under the middle. Then, you're going to take the other one and bring it under the one you just crossed over and make it become the new middle. It's a little bit hard to see, but you'll get the gist. You're going to then take the next piece, pull it in, just pull like on the regular one. Pull hair from the side, just like in the regular one, and but instead of bringing it over, bring it under. Do the same, grab some hair, bring it under, make it in the new middle. Grab some hair, stick it in the chunk, make it under, push it under. And it helps if you flatten the pieces. You don't want them all crumbled up. Don't pull it too fast or don't do it too loose. Grab another piece, pull it, put it here, and flip it under. It looks really pretty and it's really good for all kinds of like special occasions. Take another piece, grab it, stick it under. Just keep on doing this all the way down your head. The smaller chunks you grab, the smaller your braid pieces are going to be, but the bigger chunks you grab, the bigger they're going to be. I like to do bigger just because I think it looks cool, but small looks really fancy. When you get to the bottom and you need to start braiding it, you're going to start braiding it inside out. Because if you start braiding it right side out, it's going to look weird. So you're going to take, just like we did for the French braid, just pull them under instead of over. If you have layers, they're going to start to pop out, but it's okay. You can always flatten them down with water or hairspray. When you get to the bottom, fasten an elastic in it, and there you go, the inside out French braid. Thanks for watching.